I wasn't even having to look that hard to pick a cause. Children being displaced from their families and all of the the detention centers, you know, that you know, just broke my heart seeing them and, you know, how much they looked like concentration camps even. Um, it was all over the news, it was all over my mind, so it really was a case that the cause picked me. This specific piece, yes, I was thinking of, you know, children uh, displaced from their families uh, in this country, but it's actually a global situation as well. I mean, you look at, you know, refugee camps worldwide and the number of kids who don't even have a way of being traced back to their parents is, is insane. As the richest country in the world, as the biggest economy in the world, uh, you know, with that kind of power, you know, comes a lot of responsibility. So, even though it is not uh, a, a trend, a bad trend, I should say, that is going on only here, it's, it's really going internationally, but the fact that it's going on here is uh, especially troublesome. I mean, I hope actually, rather than, you know, donating to a specific uh, organization, I would hope that people would be uh, inspired to just really be uh, big in their philanthropy and, uh, you know, citizenship and donate to several institutions, you know, that cover all, you know, specs of problems that are ongoing now that are related to immigration, but most importantly, what I really, really do hope that people who engage with this project do is to vote. I hope that people who listen to the piece feel so inclined to exercise their citizenship in very active uh, and proactive ways.